guys welcome back to my channel and um, today we are going to be doing a review on I would say micro bikinis is what they're called from wish I just thought like I don't know I guess if you really like micro bikinis you can invest in them but I think like on sites like $60 for a micro bikini like you can make that yourself <laughs> um especially for that little of material just saying um but anyways i only spent a couple of dollars on these bikinis i have four to show you and um yeah i don't i don't know how i feel about them i tried on two okay and then the other two i'm gonna try on like right now but anyways, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy this video. Beware, they are kind of small. So yeah, let's just get right into it. Okay guys, so here's my first bikini and I would say this one probably has to be the worst. Um, as you can see, it's really small and um, the material is super thin. It's just like one layer and I probably could have made this all by myself with better stitching as you can see for the front it has like the stitching is kind of coming off like it is not good whatsoever but I mean if you do like wearing like sheer stuff this thing is adjustable so you can like make it smaller or um I don't know this is just like a really small bikini yeah, I would say these ties will come undone. I feel like they're not long enough on the sides. And the back, I'm not going to show you because it's just, it's like, just a string. It's not even like, it's not even like, like a regular thong. It's just more like a G-string or whatever. But anyways, um, if you do want to see the back, then that's actually on my OnlyFans. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, on to the next one. Okay, guys, so here's the next one. This one is probably my favorite because it is double layered. And the stitching is way, way better. It seems like just like a regular bikini, but I feel like there are still some flaws. Like, I feel like the strings could be a bit stronger. And they tend to roll up, but I feel like most bikinis do that. Um... And obviously, it is still small, <laughs> as uh, I don't know, as as it should be apparently. But yeah, this one also has uh, pads. They're kind of like I would say they're kind of firm. They feel kind of foamy, but this one you don't have to wear like you won't have to wear worry about like anything showing. And the back is super small, like super small. <laughs> um, yeah, but it, it is like definitely more coverage than the other one. And if you want, these are removable pads, so you don't have to have them there. So, I don't know. I probably wouldn't wear any of these unless I had my own pool, you know, because I feel like these are a little small. Maybe not the black one. I would probably wear this, but I honestly don't really like stringy bikinis because they just come up, they untie. So I don't know. But anyways, on to the last two. So this bathing suit is actually really sheer. It's white, obviously, and it would just be terrible if you got it wet. Um, you could always sew in another layer, but I would just recommend this if you like to show stuff. Or, well, basically, if you're on a new beach, I think that would be appropriate. Um, but anyways, it does have clear straps, and you know this is like adjustable where you can put it in or out. And the bottoms on these are tight 
but to be fair i am a medium in bottoms and i ordered it as a small set but the top the string to tie on your back is just not adjustable so that's actually like a really big con of this swimsuit but i guess you could tie it if you are smaller um i feel like this could be like used as a medium top um around the neck you can tie it it, it doesn't have like the clip and obviously these are still small for the behind. Um, but anyways, yeah, this one, I'm actually wearing like covers <laughs> underneath this because it's just like so sheer and so, so thin. Like, I don't know, I don't know. Um, but yeah, on to the last one, which is Basically the exact same style as this one. It's just a different color. Okay guys, so here's the exact same bathing suit in blue. The back strap is not adjustable, it's just a clip. And when I was taking off the other one, it's actually really easy to unclip. So if you if you get like a snag, like it gets caught on something or somebody accidentally like pulls it a little bit, it just might I don't know, come out. <laughs> But anyways, this one's clear too, and obviously it's the same style. This one's sheer, but I feel like obviously since it's a darker color, it would be more protection than the other one. <laughs> but um, I feel like if you pull these too hard, they will break because when I was taking off the white one, it did bust the bottom. It just broke. Okay. <laughs> But to be fair, the bottoms are not my size. They are size small and I'm comfortably a size medium. So maybe that's why. And obviously it's just like the exact same style. But yeah, I, I wouldn't recommend these. I mean, I would say take your chances if you really want to. But anyways, guys, that was it. And let me just talk about these for a little bit okay guys so now it's time for my opinion on these bathing suits i didn't even try on the blue one or the white one before doing this video um <laughs> when i took off the white one um well, let me just show you like the back clip for it like this is how you clip it on so it's really not adjustable like it's just this basic clip and then you slide it through okay so it just like unclips really easy and when I was taking off the white one it freaking snapped off like you see that but to be fair <laughs> um it's really like it's just horrible quality obviously um and this can well, uh, I mean, it's like, whatever. It just comes out of, like, the thread, pretty much. I mean, come on. <laughs> um, but anyways, I don't know. I think these bathing suits are really small. Um, I don't, I mean, unless you like being showy, like, in public, I feel like, the white one probably wouldn't be appropriate unless you're at a nude beach because that one, if you get wet, your nipples are going to show and stuff. Um, but anyways, like the red one, the blue one, they were sheer. The only one that was not sheer was the black one, which is literally double layered and it has a pad inside that you could remove. The bottoms as well were double layered for the black one and... Overall, like, the black one was really good quality. Like, it feels a bit thick, obviously. Um, and then it has better stitching as well. So, that's really good. Um, but anyways, I probably wouldn't recommend these bathing suits. Except for the black one. Because this one's, like, a micro bikini. But it is pretty good quality for the price. Like, actually, it's really good quality for the price. It probably wasn't even that much and initially I ordered like six or seven bathing suits 
but they canceled them because I guess like the merchant or the distributor distributor couldn't send them because you know they are like in China or whatever and I'm actually glad they canceled them because these I feel like they're just not worth it and like some that I ordered they were like the same as these which are like really thin but on the website it does show that they are thicker like in the pictures but the thing with their pictures is that they show the same position and then they show like different colors so it's kind of like they're painted on they're photoshopped on so you can't you can't go based off the pictures for the quality not at all i mean you can go based off the material um so you really gotta know your material um but also you know you can't really decide like how much material they're gonna put um but anyways guys i would not recommend these bikinis except for the black one but it's really hard to tell on that website they also took forever to ship like the red one and the black one i got first and then the blue and the white one i got last but they did come on time just saying um but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video and the information on these cheap bikinis um, I hope you decide not to buy from Wish. But anyways, I hope you guys have a great day, a great night, and just remember to stay positive.